Before we start the video, we'd like to give a special thanks to the sponsor of this video, PCBWay. If you haven't heard of PCBWay, PCBWay is a one-stop PCB prototyping company that offers PCB, PCBA, and PCB design services. 10 10x10 10 10 PCB boards usually cost $5, but right now when you register, you'll get a free $5 welcome bonus, meaning your first order is basically free. So if you have any PCB projects, make sure to go check out PCBWay. Hey guys, welcome back to a brand new video. In today's video, we're going to be building an all new electric skateboard. It's going to be using two of Matex hub motors. It's going to be using a 12S2P lithium ion battery pack made of Samsung 30Q cells, two VESCs, and HGL Tech's new remote controller. So this right here is the 12S2P battery from DIY Electric Skateboard. It's a great battery because it has a charge port, power switch, LCD screen, and USB ports built in. We are also going to be using DIY Electric Skateboard's Torque ESCs, which are basically just VESCs. We're going to be using two of them because it's a dual hub motor drive. To be honest, they aren't the best quality VESC that you can get, but they'll work for this project. The VESCs are connected in parallel with a parallel connector using XT90s, which we also bought from DIY Electric Skateboard, and then they'll be connected over CAN with a CAN bus connector. We are going to be using the HGL Tech Remote. We made a review on it in our last video, so make sure to check that out if you're interested in it. It's an interesting take on an electric skateboard remote. The first thing to do is plug the male-to-male -male servo connector into the proper port on the VESC, and then plug the other end of the male-to-male -male servo connector into the receiver. The next step is to plug the battery into the parallel connector by simply plugging in the XT90 connectors. You'll know that everything's okay if when you turn on the battery, everything lights up. We're going to be using the Torque Boards 12S2P enclosure which was included with the purchase of our battery. It's a really nice enclosure because it fits the battery perfectly and both VESCs sit inside We've already applied some velcro strips in the inside to hold the components. In all honesty, one of the trickiest parts of this build was just getting the two vesks and the wires to all fit inside the enclosure. It's a really tight space and it's easily manageable but it's really hard to make sure everything fits in there well. In terms of motors, we're going to be using two of Matex hub motors. We bought these from Miami Electric Boards a little while ago, and you may remember them from a previous video. We decided to try them out with the 12S2P battery this time, and the front truck is just a clone caliber 2 truck with 90mm flywheels. We're going to be using a 40 inch drop through deck that we got from skateshred.com. It's a really solid deck that we got the bottom spray painted black to make it look even more stealth. It's a really great deck option and it wasn't too expensive. We started by mounting the trucks to the deck which was a little bit of a pain because it's a drop through deck and we had to take the truck apart but it makes it so your ride is a lot closer to the ground and more stable. Next, we took all of the phase wires from the motors and all of the phase wires from the VESC and plugged them in. After the wires were all plugged in, we then again started the mission of fitting everything into the compact space in the inside of the enclosure. We then bolted the trucks to the deck. We 
Next, we took the enclosure and it mounted to the deck by drilling a hole through both the enclosure and the deck, and then putting a bolt through the top of the deck and threading a nut onto the bolt. With Black Friday coming up this Friday on November 29th, we're going to be having a bunch of discounts on our online store, Propulsion Boards. There will be a 15% discount for our 6374 190kV and our 6355 180kV motors, our Flipsky Dual 6.6 .6 VESC, our Double Kingpin trucks, and our Flipsky VX2 remote controller. This discount will run from Friday, November 29th to Sunday, December 1st, so make sure you take advantage of this deal while it still lasts. We're also going to be selling our entire inventory of our VX1 remotes, and we're going to be discounting them down to $35 from $50, so make sure you get one before our entire stock is gone. There's only 10, so it's only while the numbers last. So go make sure to check out Propulsion Boards for some awesome deals this Black Friday and Cyber Monday weekend.